Hi everyone, I'm Kaylee um, and I'm a involvement mentor at the Center for Student Involvement and today I'm here with Amita who is the president of Davis Women in Business. Do you want to introduce yourself Amita? Hi everyone, my name is Amita and I'm currently a third year studying managerial economics and technology management. I joined DWIB fall quarter of my freshman year so I'm really excited to be rounding out my college journey by serving as president during my senior year. So uh, basically what we're going to do today is just kind of go over um, uh, DWIB and like what you guys are doing in quarantine. So um, can you tell me about uh, DWIB's purpose? The purpose of DWIB is to create an empowering space for female undergraduate students. You know, we want to make sure that each and every one of our members feels uplifted and empowered. You know, despite our title, Davis Women in Business, we're accepting of all majors. We want to see women at the top of every field, not just business, empowering our associates to change their mindset from what if to really I can. So providing them the tools, the guidance, the support um, to be able to achieve that. So what makes uh, DWIB unique? We've really mastered this balance between professional development and community building. So while we have a lot of professional events, including our exclusive career fair for our members, to company tours, to info sessions, we also have a lot of more social events, bondings, retreats, so our members get to know each other, not just professionally, but really build those personal relationships that make college so special. Um, like, what, like, specifically do you think members will gain if they do join DWIB? First is friendship. It's It's been really great to see our members gain really close bonds with other members through our retreat or even through general meetings, sitting next to someone they haven't met before, but instantly forming a connection, um, as well as confidence. We've noticed our members, you know, applying to jobs that they didn't feel confident applying to before or speaking up more during events, practicing their public speaking, definitely professional development. You know, we have boards who help people um, develop their LinkedIn profiles and their resumes. Um, so being able to develop those skills and then translate in, that into the real world past Davis, past our organization. Why is DWIB a cool RSO to join? Yeah, I think like a lot of incoming freshmen, you're really scared to enter this big university. But with DWIB, instantly I felt at home. Everyone in DWIB is very, very kind. You know, we our three pillars are friendship, diversity, empowerment. So I think just having that welcoming space right right when I joined college was very inspiring. And so I think that's a really cool part of DWIB. It's it's helping you grow so much as a professional, but you, you know, you also have a home away from home. You have friends, lifelong friends. Um, you know, it's a professional organization, but you really get so much more out of it. More generally, what is DWIB doing now that everything's online? We were worried about member engagement because, you know, like one of the best parts of college, it's not just classes, but those communities that you seek yourself. So, you know, we're really worried about how are we going to still cultivate this, this engaging environment for our members? How are we going to keep this up? Um, you know, we've tried to acknowledge the situation. You know, we've been very open to all of our members, checking in with them regularly, but also trying to establish as much normalcy as possible. Normalcy and consistent communication, those are the two things that we as an organization have really focused to keep our member engagement up. Um, so do you want to tell us a little bit about how someone can get involved in DWIB, like what the application process is like? We've actually just um, decide, finalized our dates for recruitment. So we actually have a whole week of recruitment. So from October 5th to October 9th is when we're going to have, we're going to have our official recruitment week. But you can find information on our website, daviswomaninbusiness.com and you can access our application, all the links, once everything's finalized. Now let's kind of move on to what are some of DWIB's achievements? But especially this year, I'm most proud of DWIB being able to adapt. So every single year in April, we hold a women's empowerment conference called Own It, and Own It brings in about 250 attendees. It's a day-long conference. And, you know, this year we've had to make so many last-minute changes with with the pandemic, we, you know, we no longer could hold this event and there were so many moving parts. And so we as a team, the owner team, the leadership team, everyone in our community really, really put all of their, their effort into, into this event and, and trying to figure out what's the next best thing. What can we do? How can we still put something on to honor the hard work that the owner board put in and, you know, all these people who are excited for this event to take place. So instead of having the one day 
conference in April, the ONU board decided to launch a month-long um, video series on YouTube, which you can watch on our YouTube channel, Davis Women in Business. So we had speakers film videos instead and send it in, and the team worked to edit them, upload them them to our website. So I think just, you know, taking a really hard loss, like a whole years of hard work in playing this event and still being positive and optimistic and creating and still creating this event in a new platform for people to still enjoy. So that accomplishment was huge and I'm really proud of DWIP for even for being able to pull pull through with that one. Yes, thank you, Amita. Um, this has been great talking to you. Thank you for taking the time to sit down with me and you know just talk about these things that you know you know orgs are going through right now and um, I'm really grateful that you sat down with me and that um, DWIT's still contributing so much. Um, Thank you Kaylee. Yeah have a nice day. Thank you. Bye. Bye.